And now, anyone who knows this character? Ah, at the back seat. Shi <laughs> Wu. Yes, you are correct. Here is another interesting case in point. The character Wu means weapon, martial arts, or kung fu, or military. But it is structured in such a way that it includes two components. One means stop, zi, and the other fighting. Military forces should never be abused, and maintaining a certain degree of strength is for ultimately bidding farewell to arms and beating swords into plowshares. This is how we Chinese understand military power and peace. Also, you will be surprised to find many unlikely friends in Chinese and English. Proverbs conveying the same or similar messages. In Chinese, we say, "Zhong gua de gua, zhong dou de dou." Plant melons, and you will get melons. Plant beans, and you will get beans. Can anyone think of an English proverb that have similar meaning? You reap what you sow. Uh huh. Absolutely right. You reap what you sow. Now another one. In Chinese, we say, "捡了芝麻，丢了西瓜。Pick up a sesame seed, but drop off a watermelon." Can anyone think of a similar proverb in English? Penny wise, pound foolish. Great. <laughs> so, in English, there's the uh, penny wise and pound you know, foolish. All these have proven again that both the Chinese and American peoples are talented peoples, and for all our differences in culture, there are striking similarities. Between us.